At the most basic level, organizations only do two things, their normal operations and the things that change those operations. Change is achieved by completing projects, and those projects must connect with strategy to ensure the right changes are happening. Why do projects get approved in the first place? It's not because the business wants a new product, system, or process. Those are the tangible outputs of the project, but the organization is interested in the outcomes that those outputs generate. For example, a new product allows a company to increase sales, gain new customers, etc. This improves revenue and profit, and those are the reasons why the product was developed. At any point in time, a business is changing many different aspects of their operations through projects. Some of these changes will be big, impacting many areas and holding the attention of leadership. Others will be smaller, involving just a few people in one department and being visible only to managers in that department. All of these are projects, but not all of them will be part of the strategic portfolio. The portfolio comes first, and projects are attached to it based on how they connect with the strategic priorities. The big, headline projects are those that align with the goals and objectives of the entire organization, and they'll be part of the strategic portfolio. Smaller projects still have to happen, but are managed independently within individual business areas. As a result, a business may have more than one portfolio. It's easy to think about the goals of a company because those are the most well-known to employees, but each department in that company also has goals. There can be an IT portfolio that supports the IT goals, a marketing portfolio for marketing objectives, etc. Each department will provide support to the overall company or strategic portfolio as the top priority, and then will deliver the departmental portfolio with the resources remaining. You can see this gets complex very quickly, and that's why a dedicated portfolio management function is needed to manage portfolios, especially the top-level strategic portfolio. Effective portfolio management is the key to connecting strategy and execution, ensuring the business does the right work in the right way, at the right time, to achieve the goals it has set. To do this, the portfolio manager must be the center of all communications around the portfolio, establishing the portfolio as the connection between strategy and execution. Leaders work with portfolio management as the single point of contact for all work related to the business goals. Project managers and teams work with the portfolio management as the single source of truth on how to deliver projects that achieve those business goals. Portfolio management connects that leadership direction with project team execution and ensures the outputs achieved from the projects align with the outcomes needed by the organization.